first alert weather with Cassie Campbell is sponsored by St. Francis Healthcare System. Well, looking outside, depending on where you are, most of us are. There's some partly cloudy skies, maybe a little bit of some rain showers, but look at those flags. Look at the direction that they're blowing. These winds are coming out of the northwest. That's the front. We are seeing lots of sunshine across Perryville right now, and those winds Moving in out of the north, they're going to really start to make those temperatures feel better for tomorrow. Can see exactly where that front's lining up because we're the it's trying to kick up some light showers, a little bit of a some thunderstorm activity, but really might hear a couple rumbles of thunder. Overall, just some light showers moving across the area, and they're very isolated for the time being. As we head into this evening, the front will slowly continue to move to the east, which is going to move these showers out. This is future cast by around 730 this evening. You can still see a little bit of some isolated showers and possible thunderstorms. Those will clear out overnight. We'll kick off tomorrow with some a little bit of cloud coverage, but overall it's going to be lots of sunshine for tomorrow. Tomorrow afternoon, a great day, a little bit breezy out of the north, but again, it is going to make it feel much better. Way less humid for Thursday and Friday. Clear skies Thursday night into Friday. Lots of sunshine. High pressure will be overhead. That's going to give us clear skies for both Thursday and Friday. Lows tomorrow morning heading out the door. Upper 50s and then low to mid 60s depending on where you are. 65 in Union City. 59 in Mount Vernon. 61 in Marion. By the time we get to the afternoon, jumping up into the mid to upper 80s. Some areas might see 90. Look at that, 90. Poplar Bluff. Now it is going to feel a little bit better than these temperatures because of those winds. So 88 in Paducah, 87 in Marion, 89 in Cape. We'll sit in those mid to upper 80s Thursday and Friday. Beautiful days to end the work week. Looking ahead to the weekend, it is looking like we get another shot of some cooler air, which is going to increase our chances for some showers and thunderstorms for your weekend. Not a complete washout, but you are going to get caught under a couple rounds of rain Saturday, possibly lingering into Sunday. Look at that, 78 for a high on Sunday. And then 80s return by Monday with lots of sunshine.